Hey, what is up, everyone? Welcome back to another video. On today's video, before you get started, make sure you guys go ahead and subscribe and like. And basically, I'm going to be giving my opinions on UCG, aka Roblox, user generated content. And if you guys don't know what user generated content is, it's basically where Roblox allows you to make your own hats so you can actually create your own hats on Roblox apparently very, very soon. And basically, I'm going to give my review on it, I'm going to give my take on it, see if it's good or bad, and basically explain why. Now, I'm going to just be real with y'all. Most of this stuff is bad. Bad. But yeah, so let's just go ahead and get right into it. So if you guys don't know what UCG is, I'm going to go ahead and throw up a screenshot. Now this is from Decabox's video. It's basically like a little screenshot that was leaked somehow. And it basically shows what uh, UCG, aka user generated content will be. So you guys can see you can upload a mesh, um, add the texture to the mesh. So for example, I believe like a mesh would be like a Dominus, right? And then, then you would add your texture to it. So you know, Dominus Perfectus has, you know, its own texture. Dominus Arius has its own texture. So you add a texture and apparently you can choose choose if it's going to be a limited timed or on sale and you guys can see there you can also set the price to whatever you want it to be you can put how much stock you want it to have if it's going to be a limited and you can also add your own you know custom timer time to the item so like i said ucg is basically where you can create your own items on roblox now to confirm it even more, I'm not going to go into this screenshot too uh, in depth, but basically RBX Leaks found this coding in Roblox somehow and it basically just gives more proof that UCG aka user generated content will be coming to Roblox and I don't really need to explain it. If you understand what this says, then you understand it. But the one part that you should keep in mind is that marketplace fees percentage 70% guys. That is a lot, a lot of a cut that Roblox is taking. If you guys didn't know, when you sell a shirt, I believe the fees are only around like 30%, somewhere around that range, correct me if I am wrong. The fees on UCG is 70%, so if you list something for 100 Robux and it sells, you only get 30 Robux. One concern I have with UCG is that people could easily start potting this up again, like you already know in shirts, right? So let's say you go in the catalog, you search white, it's literally all the same shirts 5 million times. And this could be the same thing for UCG. What if bots take over UCG? Could you just imagine having the same color Dominus for thousands of thousands and possibly hundreds of thousands of pages? Or the same just hat in general thousands of thousands of times. So that would be terrible for the Roblox community and it would just be impossible to find what you want to find. Yes, you guys could say, you know, Roblox could fix the bot problems, but let's be real here, you guys. Roblox has been attacking the bots for at least over a year or two now and they haven't really gone anywhere. Like, the bots, they can stop them for like a month or so, but whoever creates these bots, bro, they're smart. They will come back stronger than ever and they basically are the one thing that is killing the site as long as with the other things, but you know, you know what I'm trying to say here. And another concern I have for UCG is that UCG could actually kill limiteds. You guys can see here, apparently, if this screenshot is true, which it's not, I guess, confirmed yet, it might be, I'm not too sure, but you guys can see it says limited you, so there's a button for limited you. Meaning that you can upload your own limiteds. That's first of all going to kill the market. And second of all, it's just going to kill limiteds. Like people could upload the same Dominus 500 times, right? But the other thing is people could upload Dominuses that look better than expensive Dominuses. For example, Dominus Astro. That's my favorite Dominus, okay? I don't know how much value that is, but I think it's in the millions. It's definitely in the millions somewhere, okay? People could upload a Dominus that is basically Astra, but looks 50 times better. They can customize it, and guess what? Dominus Astra, it's about to go down. And people could definitely bypass whatever, you know, guy sitting in Roblox who is accepting or declining the, the hats. There's already a group, there's literally a group of shirts on Roblox that literally have, you know, porn. Like, I'm not even kidding. There are shirts, okay, that have it, and it's somehow past the Roblox system, and they've been up for, like, weeks now. I don't know if it's still up, but back when I saw them, they were up for, like, weeks. Same thing could happen. People could make a dildo hat. Like, I'm not kidding. People could literally make a dildo hat. Let's be real here, guys. Roblox want to do this because if they kill limiteds, they sort of lose profit. Now, let's be real here. So imagine in Roblox, people are putting up limiteds for sale, like 50 limiteds go on sale every single second. People could just easily get rich, like they can easily make the stock, like I don't know, like 20 or something. 20 people buy that limited, and let's say that limited goes to like a million, you have over a million rap, alright? That is literally insane, like this is just abusing the Roblox system. But 
we have the same theory that we had before. I think what Roblox is trying to do here is, first of all, they're going to obviously make this probably like maybe OBC members only or BC members only if they're nice, all right? If they're nice and they just want their site to be abused for some reason. But what I think it is, is I heard of this theory from someone, I forgot who, um, but basically you upload the stuff and Roblox actually takes that idea and uploads it to their own page so you know they can get rid of all the abuse and everything and they can choose which ones they like basically we're just giving Roblox ideas and Roblox is you know if they like that idea they're gonna make it happen if they don't like it then they'll just trash it because it just wouldn't make sense if everyone or just BC members could do it because bots can just buy BC, bot the crap out of it. Or you can make 50 items that already look like an item and the whole catalog would be absolutely trashed. I don't really know guys, at the same time, it would be pretty cool to be wearing like a sick Dominus that no one else has and know that you made it, but at the same time, this could create a lot of problems for Roblox, so I want to know what you guys hear, make sure you guys... So I want to see what you guys think of this, should UCG be allowed? How do you guys think UCG is going to work? Make sure you guys go ahead and subscribe and like. Turn on post notifications if you did enjoy. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Thank you so much for watching. Peace out, everyone.